With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello. So our question is the energy of the electron in the second and third Bohr orbital of the hydrogen atom is given. Now here we have to calculate the wavelength of the emitted radiation when the electron drops from the third to the second orbit. In order to solve this question, first of all, we have to just know diagrammatically what is actually being said by this question. Here we are having the energy of the electron at the second orbital. Suppose this is second orbital and this is third orbital. Here the energy is given that is minus 5.42 meters into power minus 12 for the n is equal to 2 and minus 2.42 into power minus 12 for n is equal to 3. And here erg is the unit of the energy. So what happens here, suppose the electron is here, when it falls from the n is equal to 3 to 2, so what happens here, the radiation in the form of the energy is emitted. So we have to find actually the wavelength of that emitted radiation. So in order to solve this question, we will have used the formula that the change in energy, it will be equal to the hc divided by lambda, where delta is the energy difference between the uh, third and second orbital. And here h is the Planck's constant, c is the speed of light in vacuum and lambda we have to find that is for the emitted radiation. So here firstly we have to find the value of delta e. Delta e will be equal to the e3 minus e2. So if we try to solve it, what we will get? We will get the value of delta e. Suppose here we are firstly trying to solve the value of delta e. So the value of delta e, it will be equal to the 3 multiplied 10 to the power minus 12 arg. Now here what we have to do, we have to just find the value of lambda. So making lambda as the subject, it will be equal to SC divided by delta E. And we know that the value of Planck's constant, it will be equal to the 6.62 multiply 10 to the power minus 27 per second. Here we have to write the value of the speed of light in vacuum. It will be 3 multiply 10 to the power 10 centimeter per second and here the value of delta e that is the change in energy it will be equal to 3 multiply 10 to the power minus 12 erg. So from what we can say that this erg this erg got cancelled out second and per second got cancelled out. So from what we can say that we will get the lambda in terms of the centimeter and now solving it what we will get if the value of lambda is 6.62 multiply 10 to the power minus 5 centimeter. So this is the value of the lambda in centimeter. So this is the answer. I hope you got this concept. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.